This is Whitney Sandell with the Waller Pee Wee Football Association. Just want to let you know we have opened up our 7 on 7 spring football registration. You can go online at wallerpeewefootball.org and register from there. It's $100 for registration, a little more for cheer, as the cheer registration will go for spring and fall. We're currently working on our schedule and what league we're going to be playing with. And uh, looking forward to a fun field spring 7-on-7 seven seven league. Thanks. Hey, it's the radio guy, Mike Prince. Welcome to another episode of the Mike Prince Show here on the Open Mic Broadcast Network. Our assignment is to try and bring you news that you could use. Today is no exception to the rule. Follow me on Twitter at The Mike Prince Show. The YouTube channel is Open Mic Broadcast Network. The website is obnradio.com and our 24-hour dial-in message line, 713-570-6736. And without any further delay, we're going to jump right into today's episode. The Prairie View a University Panthers bowling team, which is ranked 14th in the nation, got their draw for the NCAA tournament and they'll be facing... The MEAX, North Carolina A&T. Should be a very interesting first round. Lady Panthers will try to navigate their way to the championship throne in the world of bowling. The Open Mic Broadcast Network would like to take this time to recognize its sponsors and underwriters. Attorney Lee Van Richardson, Brazos Valley Schools Credit Union, Prairie View Athletic Club, Temple of Refuge Ministries, Reflections Paint and Body Shop, Helping Hands Lawn Service, Diva Skin Conditioner, Purple Drip Daiquiri and Grill. For more information on how you can become an underwriter or a sponsor here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network, our number to call is 832-213-8824. Serving the community through faith and athletics. The Open Mic Broadcast Network, Prairie View, Texas. Light baseball schedule on yesterday evening. Only one game to record. University of Arkansas at Pine Bluff fell short to Little Rock by the score of 7-2. SWAC Conference Divisional play will start today. Panthers have a bye week this week. And of course, the buzz news all week long has been the cancellation of Prairie View next two football games leading into this weekend. Now, on the schedule, the next time Prairie View would be eligible to even think about playing would be against University of Arkansas at Pine Bluff. Right now, when you look at the Western Division, the Golden Lions sit on top with a 2-0 division record. Prairie View is right there with a 2-0 record as well. Southern University sits with a 2-1 record. Southern is scheduled to take on the Jackson State Tigers this weekend. And that should be a pretty good matchup. In fact, it will probably, in all realistic terms, be another serious test for Jackson State. They fell a little short against Alabama State last week. And we'll see how they'll rebound against the Southern Jags. And we all know how effective Coach Odom has been when he's had a chance to prepare for a team coming off a bye week. So that should be a very good matchup on this weekend. Alabama State will be stepping out of conference to play South Carolina State. Big softball matchup for the Lady Panthers. They'll be hosting the Texas Southern Tigers Friday and Saturday. In baseball... Alabama State will do battle with Alabama A&M. Southern University will take on the Texas Southern Tigers. We will have some football Friday scheduled for you on tomorrow. Lord say the same, and the creek don't rise. But as for right now, we're going to exit stage left. I am the radio guy, Dr. Mike Prince. Thank you guys so much for joining in with us. We definitely can't get it done without your input. Don't forget, subscribe to the YouTube channel at the Open Mic Broadcast Network and follow me on Twitter at The Mike Prince Show. I've got to go. You guys be blessed and we'll see you on the other side.